Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Tanks Gaming today with another Hearts of Iron 4 video. Uh, last we left off, we did finish to liberate Spain, actually. We did... Uh, no, actually, that was already a couple of videos ago. So, there has been some changes. Um, yeah, we lost all our troops which we had over here. They got overrun. And there is still two... There are still two divisions of... Free American Empire holding on to their territory. Uh, it wasn't working out the way I was thinking that it would go very, very, very fast. Uh, the Americans would have to pull back quite a lot of troops out of Europe to... Well, actually, it looks like it has kind of worked. Ah, still a lot of troops over here. And about ton of troops in there. So, I think it didn't work out the way I was hoping. Uh, we are still holding possession to part of uh, Turkey. We gave away this um, this province because they always they were always revolting. Uh, we gave it to Germany and the Germans immediately gave it to uh, Romania. Legionary Romania. Um, also down here, the Germans did actually take Yemen and Oman with a part of it belonging to the Soviet Union. Uh, also down here, the Soviet Union did uh, do a well, did do a very good push down here and uh, uh, to help the Italians, but the Italians don't own anything anymore and down here. Belgium has a big part down here in Africa still. So it's still going on. We are also produce, uh, producing Chat Fighter Mark 1s quite a lot, to be honest. Let me just check how many we are actually producing. Uh, it has been it has been a while since I pl uh, played last. I have to be honest about that. Uh, we have anti tank three. We are producing. We don't need that much anymore. We have a couple of transport planes. We have a lot. I think I can look it over here. Yes, I can. I'm a little bit yeah. Not saying anything. <laughs> Uh, we still need to produce a little bit of motorized. We are short on that. I just saw, see this. Uh, we have 1k jet fighters plus, which is cool. So on the motorized, are we still producing motorized? No, we kicked it out for mechanized. So that was a bad idea because the uh, some divisions still need um, mechanized stuff. Um, I think I'm going to pull back on infantry equipment a little bit and put that in here and you're going to the top, that was the wrong button, like this. So you should get, you should get some factories, yeah. That looks much better like, actually I'm going down like this. Yeah, I like it. I like my production way this way. Uh, we are short on... We need a little bit more rubber. And rubber we can actually still get from the German Reich, right? No, nope, we are getting the maximum of that. Uh, we can get a little from the Siemens Empire. Not that much, though. I can't get anything from the Siemens Empire. Interesting. Why not? Can we get a little bit from the Soviet Union? Uh, can export up to nine rubber units of rubber. We can only trade for up to zero units. Why? Uh, bit confused about that. Why? 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 I'm not a hundred percent sure why we cannot trade any rubber, guys. Oh well, uh, it's not that much we need, right? Yeah. Well, actually little bit still need a little bit uh, this factories has been bombed we are producing quite a lot of convoys which is still good we are still waiting on um, on jet fighters uh, we are still producing jet fighters I want quite a lot of jet fighters before we go in the Alpine region is doing okay uh, let me just check uh, month. We did take down a couple of enemy fighters and a couple of enemy bombers, which is cool. Uh, Second Republic. Okay, Brazilian has been flipped and around. And 
so on and look at that in northern france there are actually not that many fighters anymore which is interesting i think i think we should do something with that so we're going to hold very quickly here and where do we have i just have this one army left hmm Mm -hmm. I think I'm going to keep those two, um, oops, those two mechanized units, uh, split them out, take them out, yes. And create a new army. And they will actually hold this region over here. And you guys, you are going to get a new front line. Yeah, 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 I know. Uh, up here. That was wrong. Um, and delete the front line. You get a new front line. Was it control left click? Yeah, control left click. We encircle those guys. And we're trying to bop them. So march up there. Well, yeah. I mean, we need quite a lot of manpower to do what I wanted to do. I just remembered that. <laughs> <coughs> so we have to wait till the new year. Oh yeah, by the way, there was an update. And uh, you can now tell you units uh, to exercise like you always could. You could tell them carefully execute a battle plan. You can tell them, sorry, I have forgotten to tur take turn off the noises of... Uh, Discord, uh, I will do that after this recording. Uh, you can go with a balanced manner and you can go aggressive. Means uh, they will execute the battle plan no matter what or nearly no matter what. So they will do it aggressively. Um, yeah, just go. Just go. Yep. Uh, we are going down the anti-air area thing here even though we are not producing any. So why aren't you moving? Because you don't have a front line. Yep, like this. Much better. Now execute. Thank you. That was a short fight. <laughs> so uh, you're going to fortify down here. And then you will push to Calais. Like this. As soon as you're ready, you are going to go aggressively again. Very aggressively, actually. And we are pushing through here quite nicely. We did get repelled over there. Did research radar to one. Uh, we are going to go with the next radar. Centimetric radar. So we pushed nearly completely. And we pushed them out. Out of the harbor. So they do not have an order right now. They will get a new front or front line will be added to here. And uh, yeah, like this. No. Nope. That didn't seem to work. Like this. Oops, that, that was the wrong button again. Like this. Much better. Uh, like this. Okay. And execute as soon as you're ready. And that should give them also again a little experience. Of course, this infantry regiment, uh, it's just a border brigade. Uh, there's just two border brigades. And I, I wonder why they are like this. But yeah, we are pushing in here quite nicely. We should get this harbor back in a second here. Uh, probably gonna lose the border brigade. Probably. I'm not really anticipating to hold them. Yep, they already done. And now you should be able to get this part over here. Nope. And the super heavy tanks. Uh, they are being researched. Ooh, crap. Okay. Um, down here we have everything researched. Down here we could go mechanized 3. Let's go mechanized 3. It's not that we are, we are producing any of those. So, uh, stop delete all the battle plans and you're getting a new front line over here 
like this. Yeah. Uh, get in position. And as soon as everybody is in position, we will start the push again, even though... Uh, disadvantage. I don't care, support. Uh, I haven't drawn a battle plan yet. Um, Rotterdam, like this, yes. And now execute, please. Uh, this push is working pretty good. Uh, this one wasn't working as well. Uh, actually, it was a defense. And because we did the push here, uh, they broke quite fast and had to fall back. Look at that, the French have troops again. They landed again in Brest. Uh, th that's actually the new capital of France. And um, yeah, we are. We did push over here. Uh, it's not going as good as it could go, so we are going to stop this. As I stop. Yep. Thank you. Uh, I think I can go right clicking. Now they're supporting without moving. Which is helping. Ah, we lost one Grand uh, Border Guard. <laughs> or Grand Brigade, how it's called here. In German. Oh, and yes, we have Rotterdam. And for the moment, you will just. Uh, actually, uh, no, that's actually good. How is it if we are going to take Amsterdam? You are good. Well, then push for it. Take Amsterdam. They might capitulate if we take Amsterdam. Okay, we have done this research. We are going down the next tree. Next part. Oh, I still have... What? Low manpower. Ah, okay. It took a second to go away. Um, we did take Amsterdam. How about if you try to take ha Hague? The Hague. Uh, and execute. Okay, uh, the heavy, t super heavy tanks have been researched. Um, how about we stop the time for a second here? <laughs> Everything down here is researched. Everything down here is researched. Air doctrines, we are still going. Um, it's 1950. I'm going for the fighters too. Uh, yeah, that should work out nicely. I think we will be able to take The Hague in a second here. We are already... Let me see how it's going on against Americans. Against Mark Clark. And we took The Hague. Which is nice. Which is very, very nice. And we are kind of losing, I think. Actually, we are going to stop that right away. Uh, we are going to delete... I'm going to delete, I said, uh, I wanted to delete this battle plan, okay. Uh, you don't have a battle plan anymore, uh, but you will get a new one, which is just this front over here. Yes, and you will get, try to push in here. Try to push in here. Right? Yeah. Now you get ready. We wait for the German troops. And look at that. I think those are paratroopers which landed in Will. The back lands there. Which is kind of sad. It makes it kind of hard <laughs> to control anything over here. Uh, I have a lot of political power. I'm not quite sure what I should do. Let's start flip, little flip the United Kingdom. And actually London. I think that could be a decent idea. I don't know if it is, but okay, the doctrines are done. Uh, we are on jet tech bombers. Yeah, let's let's research that. Oh, I can't because I need to go first normal bomber row. Yeah, let's start researching the normal bomber row though. It wouldn't hurt. So if we go here and this and boost party popularity, uh, fascist. Yep, that. Could work out nicely. We might flip the Brits. Ooh, crap. Uh, Vichy France came very, very far down here. 
they're actually trying to come towards Lyon. I don't really like that. My troops up here are holding, I think, quite nicely. Uh, holding the pocket of the Netherlands. Unfortunately, they still have two harbors here, which gives them quite... Oh, look, there are paratroopers. But they are attritioned. And if, if the Germans would send... We are at a disadvantage because superior enemy and the division is still preparing. If the Germans would send some, some help, that would help out nicely. Or the Italians, but they have their handful over here. Uh, we are actually losing this battle. Um, you, buddy. Come over here. Um, you, my friend. Who are you? You should come over here as well. We need to hold Lyon. We need to hold Lyon really, really good. And actually, I do not care about... Yeah, we will fight those guys off. They are actually attritioned. And as soon as this, this is done... Uh, I actually don't care anymore. I want you guys down here. Um, I think I want you guys over here. I want the new front line over here. Yep. And I'm going to assign you to this front line. And you get a new offensive line, which is like this. Perfect. And this one here gets deleted. I don't care. They took back Amsterdam already. They're quite fast in that way. Is that one of my units? Yep, just move out. So there's no more defense up here in the Netherlands and look at that, how, they, how fast they're spreading. I think this is the final push of the Allies, which will be the breaking point of the Axis. To be totally honest, I think that's going to be the breaking point. I wonder, I wonder if it will, if I'm right or not. But I'm pretty sure this is going to be the breaking point. Yeah, 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 I know. I am low on manpower. Argentinian League, League has capitulated. Um, you guys, you should go like, uh, like this. Um, Gary Lyon. Leon. Actually, yeah, execute. Actually, uh, execute in here. Hold, hold, hold. Hold, hold, hold. Execute in here. That looks nice. I think I'll be able to cut those guys off. And then I push over here. We are kind of losing. They're pushing pretty hard, but always falling back as well. Uh, I think we did overrun here. Yes, we did. Perfect. And uh, now you guys will come in here to Vichy. That's probably why they were so aggressively fighting over here. Because they were trying to get a hold. Oh, look at that. The Netherlands are back. <laughs> Brussels is back. <laughs> There's a bit of a British country down there. But yeah, I think, uh, I think we are pretty much done here. The Germans uh, have nothing to push them back, it looks like. Um, we did take Vichy back, which is nice. Uh, I'm going to expand the front line over here a little bit. As well as this front line is going to go through here like this, I think. And as soon as, he's, as this army is ready again, I start to push again. I think that's the only thing I can do to avoid the inevitable. To try to hold on as long as possible and hopefully get the win, uh, the victory screen or the, the end screen pretty soon. I mean, we are in August 1950. I don't know how long it will go on. But anyway, guys, that's going to be it for this video. If you did like this video, please hit the like button. You can also subscribe to my channel or follow me on Facebook or Twitter. The links will be in the video description. And like always, guys, one more time, thank you very much for watching. And I hope to see you in my next video. Bye.